Good morning guys, welcome back Elish Ryder and Elish Kitty here <laughs> So, day two of our journey in Jerez National Park uh, Let's see What the day reserves to us uh, oh Shit, this is really tight Okay Are you ready? Mrs. Yes, freezing. Time to go. <laughs> and I'm glad we planned several days here that we can revisit the same places but without people. <laughs> so we can make drone footage and, and record properly. Let's see what the day brings us today. And guess what? Off-roading. <laughs> yeah, but I think I think it's worth it. Come on, nobody's coming here. Ah, but it's beautiful. Come on, along the dam. Ah, this is not off-roading. Come on, this is just oh, danger zone. Okay. And they didn't said how many kilometers, <laughs> so we don't know. Maybe it's like 50 kilometers. They only said that six, well, that's six, right? Yeah, we can can only be there till 6:30. Maybe it's 30 kilometers, maybe 100. Oh, so it's the time to get there. And you you spend five minutes and then you need to come back. <laughs> ah, look at this. This is quite enjoyable, right? Uh. Pa, pa. Ah, nice track. Well, one thing I can guarantee, if we had to walk, I wouldn't come here. <laughs> it's too fucking far away. A waterfall here already in a tiny bridge that's beautiful that's freaking beautiful it's a beauty it is okay let's go for the next one there are people here do you think they are natives or something like the barefoots <laughs> <laughs> they, they look tired <laughs> Maybe it's a long walk <laughs> Okay, I think we are reaching the point I think we're gonna stop here I don't see the village <laughs> And I don't see a path to go with the bike so <laughs> Let's check it out Well guys it was supposed to be here the old village it was supposed to be here underwater but we can't see shit <laughs> we can only see a few places marked with the stones so everything is um oh god bless you we see the port over there built with stones we see a lot of uh, areas marked by the stones and split it by the stones I don't know if it was the the space for the houses or not but or it's destroyed or it just disappeared because we can't see shit from here but it's very beautiful though it's quite nice and relaxed and imagining that people already lived here I don't know, maybe prehistoric people? Because I don't see any, any signs of buildings, only, only the walls. Yeah, and, and the landscape from here, come on, imagine living here, in this place. <laughs> you just see the lake and the mountains in front of you, man. It's beautiful, beautiful. 
damn just just look at these views we just got another road a different road from yesterday and we came across this place beautiful place man look at the design of the valley beautiful man beautiful and look at the road it's a tiny road but the design of it is and I don't think it's very used because the vegetation is growing in the shoulders ah really nice man really nice gorgeous oh there's a, a bridge over there <laughs> let's try to see from here oh damn <laughs> damn this is high yeah. let me check the bridge <laughs> <Let's see. laughs> let's check this out Oh, this is a mini, mini dam. <laughs> a really tiny mini dam. Oh, this is a nice pool, isn't it? It, it looks deep. <laughs> Maybe we can go for a swim. Uh, yeah, from this side there's no water. What the hell? Because it goes on that side. Ah, but the valley, man, it's beautiful. Beautiful. It's kind of a nice picture, right? Kind of. Ching. Uh, just to show you guys the views from the dam where we were before just look at this well, it's a nice nice sightseeing from the from the dam and the views of the valley awesome pretty cool Let's continue in this gorgeous, gorgeous mountain with these gorgeous views all over the place. Look at this, man. It's valleys, valleys, mountains, cliffs, forests. Man, this is freaking beautiful. So, Tenere is 116 horsepower, and here I see 3 horsepower, 
in the middle of the road like I told you guys here in the Jerez National Park we have a lot of wildlife including horses I just hope we don't find like those horses in the middle of a turn maybe it's gonna hard to to not hit the guy <laughs> Damn, this is really stiff And in Roman stones, not easy uh, Shit <laughs> Are you, oh, okay We have tarmac again uh, Are you okay? Cutelo You know what is a cutelo? You don't know what, what the cutello is? No. It's a big knife to cut meat. <laughs> That's a cutello. Normally only the butcher uses use this. Yeah. These really really old villages man around here. In the in these hills, the, the house is built on stone still. It reminds me the, the village of my grandmother, Malhada Velha. It's exactly this style and this old. And today I'm loving, loving the fact that there's almost no traffic in the road. Much less people than yesterday, man. And this is the other side of the hill. Look at this, another valley, another bunch of hills and valleys and awesome man, awesome. Like I said, it's a little bit cloudy today, but even though, really nice. Just, just look the beauty of this village man. The house is still in stone. Unbelievable. Beautiful. Beautiful. Just look look at the tiny streets. Look at that. This this is something you don't see every day, man. These remote places and that transport you to different times completely don't be scared doggy doggy don't be scared oh and this is also something very typical from this area the the people here use these tiny houses on top of the of the rocks to dry the um, the crops during the winter they would keep dry uh, and the summer as well it looks like a mini church but it's not it's to dry the crops <laughs> it's a very typical thing from this area you see another one there really old everybody like everybody has one oh a cafe nice <laughs> Very nice village, very nice. I just don't like these turns in, in Roman stones. Look, the road down there, beautiful. 